This is FYI on your TV brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham. I have got Laura Lee Davies with me. Thank you very much for joining us today. My goodness, you are a busy, busy person. You're the manager of programs and community outreach for our Rideau Lakes Public Library. How many branches of libraries do you have? We have five branches. So we have Elgin, Delta, Newborough, Portland, and our new South Elmsley branch that used to be in the Lombardi Public School is now in the old OPP station on the Highway 15. So, I mean, do you spend a day a week at each place? How do you work <laughs> your time out? My goodness. It, it just depends on where the programs are, but uh, we do, I do hold four, um, in four branches, our play, learn, and story times on a, on a weekly basis. So those are worked, and then the fifth branch is just a little bit smaller, and we do special events there too, but uh, all of our activities, we really try to move them around in all five branches, so we're using them all. And you know, when, when you talk about those programs for, for, for children to come out with their parents and caregivers and grandparents and aunts and uncles, whoever, yeah. it's such a great resource for the children, but it's a great yes. resource for the adults and the caregivers to get together too. It really is. Um, it's certainly an early literacy development, but it's also a social development for the parents and just to feel that they're in this together. Um, parenting's hard work. So uh, it's nice to get together with something that's all set up um, that, you know, a lot of parents think, oh, Laura Lee does the mess. <laughs> <laughs> It's great. We have the paint and the water and all those kind of fun things. And our libraries lend the space. And, and thanks to Country Roads Community Health Centre, we actually uh, hold one of our programs there as well. Um, so we just, because they're one of our branches, is small. So we have lots of great community partnerships and, and helping parents is, and, and children are A1. Well, and, and you've been doing this, well, maybe not you specifically for a long time. My daughter's going to be 29 this year. And I can <laughs> remember taking her to uh, different programs at the Lombardi School library when the library was there but now you're pretty yes. much across the street down the road a little bit <laughs> yes but yes yeah and you know even though it's just down the street i'm very lucky and i get to visit all four of the public schools that are in our catchment area um, because i get to visit there once a month and read to all the classrooms the families really know about the library so our foot traffic and our use of our programs and in our library is really well it's it's fantastic and, and the library is so much more than just books as well, too. Oh, it's so much more than books. It's the it's tech. You know, you can come in and use your computers. There's movies. There's magazines. Um, a lot of students from the high school just walk down, and they're doing their homework after school in there. Um, we have events for adults. We have events for kids. Um, there's just... There's just so much. It's such a community um, hub. Uh, we're a one-stop shop. It, it's amazing how many families come in and say, hey, I just moved here. We noticed that during COVID. And we're the, you know, where do we go? And that's what we have. We go, oh, we're the resource. We can say, don't forget this, 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 and this. And here's the parks and here's the what's in town. And it, it's wonderful. Our staff are phenomenal for really guiding people where to go and what to do. Absolutely. And how long have you been doing this? Um, I'm on my fifth year this September. So you did this through COVID too? Oh yes, we I ran, we called it the Barney Show in my basement. I set up a, uh, um, uh, like a class or I mean an online show downstairs and we did play, learn, story time twice a week and baby program too. And it, it ran the whole time, it was fantastic. I mean, we were so lucky. The families were so yes. supportive. Yeah, we were so lucky with technology because it kept us connected. Oh. Yeah, well, I, it was a learning curve for me, and uh, we made it work. Yeah, yeah, you so, absolutely yeah. did. You absolutely mm -hmm. did. Now, you've got a great event coming up, too, and that is on June 12th. Yeah. Let's talk about that. Yeah, so Jill Heinerth is a famous underwater explorer. She's a writer. She's a photographer. Her pictures are phenomenal. She's a speaker and a filmmaker, and she's actually from, like, Carlton Place. She's famous. Um, we describe her as the astronaut under the water on her research. Um, so she actually visited us during COVID online because we were hoping to have her in person, and now she's actually coming to us in person. We're so gracious that she's making the time. So she's bringing a lot, you know, filmed footage um, and videos of her underwater exploring because she's been in um, expeditions into icebergs in Antarctica, volcanic lava tubes and submerged caves worldwide. So um, it, it's just a phenomenal um, opportunity to listen to her. And she's really interesting to hear. She's just phenomenal. Well, just so the things she's done. Wow. Oh, like just, you have to see where she's gone. It's so scary. And I do know of one that she 
was coming up and a polar bear swam over top of her. Like she said, the scariest moment of her life, not being inside a lava tube. No, oh my goodness. <laughs> So she's she's very courageous and uh, she's also um, she's part of the uh, first explorer in residence of the Royal Canadian Ge Geographical Society. She's the fellow of the International Scuba Diving Hall of Fame. She's an underwater Academy of Arts and Sciences. She's the Women Divers Hall of Fame and the Explorers Club. And she was awarded with the William Beebe Award for Ocean Exploration. She's written two books, Into the Planet and her new children's book, Aquanaut. Um, we will have books there as a door prize um, and people can shop for books online. But uh, we're really, really happy that she's coming to spend time with us and to kind of kick off our really new branch and we're really seats are limited so we can put 100 in there and we're at 70 so we're really excited wow wow now it's good for you for doing this too as a local person from carlton place you know i know we, we got to learn it's about wonderful. people like this yeah and it's she's inspiring women right young women and young young kids and um and as well our friends of our library um always help us out so they're gonna have fresh baked goods and some beverages there and we'll make it very uh very cozy so uh, you want people to register ahead of time yes there is a registered link right on our website right on our facebook page or they can cost contact me directly that's fine too they can call the library but they need to book a seat because we can only take 100 in the hall all right now this is june 12th and it's at seven o'clock at night seven o'clock at night on a monday night and in our new south elmsley branch but we're holding it in the hall which is still in the same building excellent, so it'll be excellent. great now how do people yeah. register for this so there is a, um, a QR code on the poster in our website and all they have to do is hold their phone over it or they can just call the directly right to the library or they can email me at lauralee at rlpl.ca and there's many ways to register. Just get a hold of the library and we'll, we'll book you in. All right. And the address of the library is 441 Highway 15. Lombard. Yes, please. Yeah, and it's the it's the um the works garage building and the old OPP station all in one and we're in the middle. So the halls on the end, the uh, the works garage in the, on the other end and we're in the middle. All right. All right. Now you, you've been doing this for 5 years, you say? 5 years and it's wonderful. We we just Vicky and I and Maddie, we all the staff, we have a great time and we and uh, have a great CEO. We get to do lots and lots of stuff, so that, that, that's it's amazing too. So you must have been around when they were building the library too. So you saw that. Oh yeah, we got to be all part of that that planning. It was fantastic. Yeah, it was a real, real team effort. Excellent, excellent. Well, yep. we look forward to this. This is wonderful, and I, I so appreciate you giving uh, uh, giving Jill Heinerth a, a resource to come out, and we've got to learn about people like this. My goodness, when know, you said Carl right. Place, it's like I know, and everything she's done in your backyard, in your backyard, exactly. Exactly. Can I share that summer's coming up yes. and I really want to let families know that my programming schedule will be out in the next couple of weeks, but July and August, we uh, run programs in uh, the parks like Kin Park, Shillington, Delta, and within the libraries as well. So watch that schedule. Um, there are TD summer reading and special events. So there's lots going on. We have a big trailer now and you can see us parked in the park and we set up a whole bunch of outdoor stuff it's excellent. fun excellent now i, I found you on facebook so you're on facebook as uh we're on facebook instagram our website is www.rlpl short for rego lakes public library.ca and uh you can yeah it's easy to find us we have a beautiful new website so it's really easy to navigate so you look at that one website and you will find one of the five libraries oh yeah you'll yes. see everything okay. yeah Everything's very accessible and want, follow us on Facebook and Instagram because we are current and we keep it up daily and we're always doing our advertising well and um, it's uh, it's a, our way to, to keep people reminded but you can also sign up for a newsletter if you get our newsletter once a month you're totally in the know so just go to our website sign up for the newsletter it's free and once a month you'll get everything. And you're very responsive very quickly on your Facebook page as well. <laughs> <laughs> well, everybody pitches in on that. It's pretty oh, good, yes. <laughs> that's wonderful. That's wonderful. Well, thank you very Great. much for joining Thanks, us Kathy. today, Laura Lee Davies. And you are the manager of programs, with a plural, <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> and the community outreach for Rideau Lakes Public Library. So thank you very much for joining us. And thank you for putting on this event. It sounds so exciting. Awesome. Thank you so much for having Rideau Lakes Public Library.